And not only was the sign snapped off the pole here when the victim flew into the air, but the casing to the street lights was also shattered. You can see the pieces of it still here on the ground. As you have heard and, uh, and can imagine, there's quite a bit of damage believed to have been done to the car involved in this. Again, a dark blue metallic car. So folks are being asked to keep their eyes open. If you see a, ve a vehicle that color with uh, front end damage, maybe some broken lights, perhaps a, a shattered windshield, you are asked to call police. Reporting live in College Park, Megan McGrath, News 4. Follow back to you. Thank you, Megan. Another pedestrian accident we've been following all morning. A garbage truck was backing up this morning on 13th Street near 8th Street in Northwest D.C. when it hit a man pinning him under the tire. Crews eventually got him out and rushed him to the hospital. The driver did stay on the scene. We're still working to learn how he's doing and how the crash happened. And Don't. the NBC police are investigating several incidents in Northeast that took place within blocks of each other. Jonas, overnight. please sit this down. It's not fun. Someone was stabbed on South Dakota Avenue, not far from Jonas. the hospital, about 12 hours Jonas. ago. Jonas. We're still working to find out what condition that person is Jonas, in. Jonas, come here, sit down, please. Come get some water. Whether two crashes and a shooting in that same area are connected. Officers say they got a call around 7.30 about this wreck on the uh, Gatlin place. When they got on the scene, they found one man had been shot. We were working to find out his condition, but this is what Erica Gonzalez told us. The homicide detectives are now leading the investigation into this case. Police are also trying to figure out if another crash nearby that happened around the same time is connected to that one. And right now